Howdy everybody! For today's project I wanted to design a simple cardboard dice or component tray that you can customize with whatever pattern you want. It's light and small so it can fit in most game boxes and you can also stack it up and store it on a shelf that way. So let's try making one! To start, go to the link shown below and print out the template on plain paper. Then using spray glue or a glue stick, glue the template onto the printed side of some cereal box cardboard or something of similar weight. Next we're going to choose the covering you want. You can use colored paper, fabric, wrapping paper, or find a patterned image online. Now you want a pattern large enough to cover a whole piece of paper. Then you're going to glue your covering paper to the back side of the cardboard. Once the glue has dried, score all the dashed lines on the template using a ruler and something like a butter knife or a knitting needle. You want to stretch the fibers here but not cut through them. Then cut out the two pieces along all the solid lines using a sharp knife or scissors. Pre-bend all the triangular tabs. Working your way from one end, bend the long piece into a peaked hexagonal ring. Apply some hot glue to the end tab and then hold it in place until it's set. If you want felt or velvet on the inside of your tray, you can add this layer now and cut to size. Align the center triangle tabs so they all sit flat against the table. Then apply glue to the tops of all the triangles at once and press the hexagon base on top. And there you go. Now a simple one today, but hopefully a fun way to make some personalized trays. Now go out there and give it a try yourself. I'm David and I'll see you next time on Upgrade DIY.